Good day, friends. Today I'm going to teach you how to tie a bow tie in honor of Dress Like Matt Smith Day. Welcome. First, I like to pop the collar so that you can see exactly what it is I am doing. Next, get your bow tie ready by pulling it out the bow tie. You'll see that it is shaped in a peculiar way. There, it almost looks like there are fish on each end. Now, many bow ties have adjustables in the back, which you might want to adjust depending upon how long your neck is. Now, first to start how to tie a bow tie, you must set it at the back of your neck on your collar and pull it around and see if it's fitting all right. So there. Next, cross the left over the right and pull up slightly so that they cross like so. Now we're going to tuck the left tail under the right like you would start a normal tie and pull straight up. Now it may look like this is choking me, don't worry, this is a big shirt since I'm a female and this is a male's shirt. So once we have a nice knot up here, you can toss that left side over your shoulder for later. Now, we're going to take a look at this tail here. It's quite lovely, isn't it? If I could wear the tie like this, I would, not really. But this is where you're gonna to wanna to fold the bow tie next, except it's going to be going this way, across your top button. Now, I like to grab it from the inside, like so, and then fold here. Now if you examine, later we're going to have to stick our thumb under this part of the bow tie. So you'll see that this part is just one flap, whereas this side is a loop. That's important, remember that. Now we take this tail, it comes back into play. Now is when we're going to need to stick our thumb underneath to reach. As I stick my thumb underneath here, I can find a hole. Oh, look at that. I can pull this flap back, the rounded side, and you'll see my thumb is right there. That's important because now we're going to take this tail, fold it halfway, and feed it through so that we have another rounded edge that comes out on the other side. Be careful as to this tail does not get lost. Now that I have another loop on this side, you'll see that I have two rounded loops and two flat loops. If I pull the two rounded loops that are on opposing sides, here we have rounded loop in the front and rounded loop in the back. It tightens the middle to make our knot. Now, this looks like a wonky bow tie right now because we have this flat loop. It's flat side, loopy side, loopy side, flat side. Now this flat side is getting a little lost and we don't want it to get lost. So I'm gonna adjust by holding onto this loopy side and this flat side and pulling to make it even. Now I'm gonna do the same for this one. Then we pull both make it tight, and keep fixing until we have an equal bow tie. There's mother in the background. Wave, mother. <laughs> so once we match them up and have equal lines, we shall have the perfect bow tie. Alrighty, next step. I'm gonna fold this down. Fold down my collar. Some shirts have a snap underneath. Comme ça, like ça, final adjustments, and there we are. I'd say that's a rather lovely bow tie. And that's how you tie a bow tie, friends. And remember, bow ties are cool. Why, yes, it is an alpaca sweater. <laughs>